Here we are. We're going about to go into flavor tripping, uh, in which we take berries and uh, see what happens. We're supposed to change our taste buds by coating them. I'd like to introduce to you our gracious host and the man who's put this uh, fantastic event together, uh, the mustache commander from the shadow government. Food <laughs> tasters of San Francisco! Welcome, you are courageous souls, to uh, uh, present your stomach with the amount of acidity that is about to hit it. It's going to be painful. We will provide antacids on the way out. Um, otherwise, you know, I don't want to say too much because you're not here to hear me talk. You're here to look at my beautiful mustache. I understand. I mean, like I said, so, you, so you're chewing the berry. How long have you been chewing the berry for? 30 to 45 seconds. Yeah. Right. What does it taste like? The berry. A good watermelon. Mmm. Like a watermelon jelly rancher. Are you buying it? Is it working? With the acidic fruits, it's pretty obvious. Guinness definitely tastes different, but there are some things like that don't really change much. Like what didn't change? Um, the cheese didn't seem to change much. I don't know. Is this actually working? It's amazing. It's really trippy. Are you, are you buying it so far or not? Uh, some things definitely, some things sort of. Like lemon, lime, definitely. And I'll, yeah. But what about, what would you say is like this is the least convincing part of the experience? Um, the cheese. The lemons take like, taste like lemonade. The pickles taste like ketchup. What are you eating there? I'm eating blue cheese. And what are you getting? It all tastes sweet. It tastes kind of like fennel to me. Like The olive tastes like bacon. Does it work? It's not as intense as I was expecting, but... Like what were you expecting? I was expecting it to be like crazy, crazy intense. Like nothing tasted like it should, but it's just... Like, it's just, like, it's exaggerated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The scotch is the best. Really? Yeah, the scotch is a trip. Yeah. Go, 60 seconds. Two, three, four, five. I uh, have eaten my berry with the, uh, the, the protein that's supposed to have coated my tongue. And I'm now trying this lemon for the very first time. Salmon vinegar. Let's see how it goes. I could drink that all day. <laughs> Actually, I mean, it'd be totally disgusting, but I could drink it all day. Go. All right, here we go. This is true bravery on the behalf of your Wired.com correspondent. This is oyster with lemon all up in it right now. All right. Tabasco? Don't oh, do it. Don't do it. Oh. <laughs> Don't eat the shell. <laughs> Wow. I gotta say, it tastes a little bit like lemon sherbet. Oh, Jesus, tequila. Tequila. Alright, as long as we're. There's only so much you can do with us. I don't like that. It's great. It tastes like a band aid. No, I don't like this. It tastes perfect. I still think bad tequila it tastes like bad tequila. I'm here with Ashley, Ashley Hodge, and she's gonna sum it up for us. Like, what do you think? Do you think this actually works, or do you think it's just sort of like uh, a kind of collective hallucination? Um, I think that's possible. It was great. It was really cool. Would you do it again? Um, for $25, I don't know that I would. Um, but you buy from the wholesaler. I would buy from the 